Hello, trivia lovers, and welcome to my channel. I'm your host, Mr. Quizter. Today, the topic is mixed knowledge. You'll have 10 questions and four multiple choice options for each. Don't miss the bonus question right after question number 10. Here we go. Question number one. Below, you see the double helix of a DNA molecule, but what does the letter A represent in DNA? Is it atom, acid, area, or axis? The answer is acid. Question two. What is the name of the space telescope that was launched into low Earth orbit in 1990? Is it Newton, Copernicus, Kepler, or Hubble? The answer is Hubble. Question three. Daydream Believer was an international hit in December of 1967 for which group? Is it The Monkees, The Doors, The Beatles, or The Rolling Stones? The answer is The Monkees. Question 4. What is the name for the left and right lower chambers of the heart which pump blood to the body? Is it Vena Cava, Atrium, Ventricle, or Aorta? The answer is ventricle. Question number five. Which famous singer was born Marvin Lee Ade on September 27, 1947? Is it Frankie Avalon, Meatloaf, Smokey Robinson, or Frank Zappa? The answer is Meatloaf. Question six. What was the name of Clark Kent's boss at the Daily Planet from the Superman comics? Is it Harvey Dent, J. Jonah Jameson, Bradley Stokes, or Perry White? The answer is Perry White. Number 7. The Bay of Plenty is a region found off the northern coast of which of the following countries? Is it Canada, New Zealand, Cuba, or Ireland? The answer is New Zealand. Question 8. What was the name of the BBC television comedy series featuring Ronnie Corbett and Ronnie Barker? Is it On the Buses, The Likely Lads, About Face, or The Two Ronnies? The answer is The Two Ronnies. Question 9. The highest platform in Olympic diving is situated at how many meters above water level? Is it 3, 5, 10, or 15? The answer is 10. Here comes question number 10, followed by your bonus question. If you've enjoyed this quiz and you'd like to support the channel, it only takes one second to leave a like and make sure to subscribe so you don't miss any future videos. Question 10. The role of Pony Boy Curtis was played by C. Thomas Howell in which 1983 coming of age movie? Is it St. Elmo's Fire, The Breakfast Club, Stand By Me, or The Outsiders? The answer is The Outsiders. And here is your bonus question. I'll leave the answer in the description for you to check. Before you go, let me know your score in the comments and click on one of these for your next quiz. What is the only country in the world to have three capitals, legislative, administrative, and judicial? 